Hello everyone on YouTube, you join me in uh, at the top of the very snowy shrine of Azura, up on the mountain here, yes, uh, there's the lady herself. Um, last time we uh, found Alduin's wall in the cast fire after many a tense combat situation and uh, here we are at the shrine of Azura, uh, back from being beaten by those pesky vampires down in a ruined village down in East March. Which I think we are going to go again. Now, um, we did use the Shimo Kiba last time, which was one of my weapons, but I have been talking to some of my uh, followers, and I think they're right in saying that it's a bit too OP at this stage in the game. Faunts my no OP uh, um, preventative measures, if you like. So I think maybe Torfin here is ready for a bit of a change of direction of where he's going. Oh, there's still the same damn ice, ice race here. Damn you. Excuse me why I just knocked this guy's black gun. Yeah, almost. Come back here. Stupid dog. There we go. Anyway, um, I think we might uh, actually just in fact go to the Forsaken, uh, yeah, Forsaken Cave after all. And find out what's there. And after all, we're, we're, we're not being fair on poor old Nirali. Ari. Ari Lucien. Lucien. Did you get lost again? Oh well. He'll come soon. Of that I've uh, no doubt. Well, some very strange goats here. What's this over here? Ah, a, a drop again. Nothing my trusty old Nord's, Nord ways won't uh, help. And a drop into a suspicious looking fort as well. Hmm. Up. Down the mountain. We come round the mountain when she comes. Oh yes. Stunning voice works there. Oh. Skeletons, I knew it. For Castab, huh? I don't know if this was an Imperial spot or not. Oh! Wizards! Indeed! I couldn't have said it better! Hello, if you're just joining us, by the way. Oh, God. Avoid the ice. Ulcian! Don't worry! Oh, really? Not even conceive, you say? Uh, no, wrong word. <laughs> I have some poison. Uh, where are you now? Have some dragonborn power. And I'll just get some healing and stamina for me. Hit him before he gets up again. God, you're a tough one, aren't you? Uh, Lucien, you alright? Oh, yep, hopefully you are. Oh, there's another skelly. Boom! Got that one straight away. Right then, we've got some very powerful wiz wizards here. Be on your guard. Uh, don't want this to be, um... Ooh, a sumer trench knife. Very interesting. I'm assuming that's from immersive weapons. Anyway, Lucian, be on your guard. Um, we should probably... Got this place of any wizards we find. Oh yes. Fort cast out prison. This can't be good where we're going. Well, can't be good for them. Especially not for skeletons. Because <coughs> we are armed with some very powerful spells indeed. Anyone in here? No. It just leads up again. door. Hello? Wizards! Where do you keep your secrets? Oh, there's a person over there. Necromancer Adept. Hello? Oh, definitely not. Ah, he's wearing armor. Sod him. 
fear poison recipe. No, we, we don't really need this, but I could give it to uh, Lucian, maybe a bit later. Lucian, why aren't you using a bow? These skeletons are such good target practice. I'm surprised. What do you need? Uh, yes, I need I need All you right to then. come over here. Yes, Listen well. to me when I'm talking to you. Okay. Um. Uh, let's talk about Certainly. tactics. Let's talk about your combat but style. Of course. Uh, fight as an archer. I shall rain arrows on them from afar. Hopefully they won't shoot back. Good. On Brilliant. So, you're going to take out your ball now, Lucian, then. Or not, okay. Alright. Well, we'll just see how it does. Um, hmm, excuse me. Uh, when it gets going. Anyway, these necromancers have any treasure? Oh, an empty chest. Not really. Apparently they were very poor necromancers. Haha. -ha. Apart from bodies, they don't have much. Okay, uh, this is just the prison, okay. Right, Lucian, um, may as well check out the front of the fort. Just to make sure this area is, is uh, stripped clean of the undead. And affrontations to Meridia. Oh, yes. Uh, here? No. <clears throat> oh, the captain's quarters, huh? If you'd asked, I'd have moved. That would, would have been good of you, but I don't think we really need that right now. Hmm. Windhelm Sewers, Kastav Sparrow, huh? This goes to Windhelm, eh? And despite this being a captain's quarters, we found absolutely no one in here, really. Very curious. Lucian, be on your guard. Robes of the Shadow Moon. Costing spell restores stamina equal to 15% of its cost. Huh? That sounds like a rather powerful and also good item to have. Restores stamina. Huh? Um, although it's not really what I want, which is destruction bus right now. Oh well. Um, That comes with a master lock, that tunnel to the Windhell sewers, so uh, I'm just going to sort of stay out of there from now on. We can get to the sewers in, in well, in Windhelm, for a start. So, uh, we, we don't need to go in there. Um, okay, I think this area is pretty clear of undead, Lucian. Lovely, good for us. Uh, let's go going again. Whoop. Oh. Whatever this fort was, it was clearly something pretty major. I mean, look at all these defences. Darper Septon was really careful when he built these forts. Uh, Lucian? Lucian! Oh well, he'll make it back, back eventually. <laughs> uh... Deathly Ruin that way, or Pub that way. Hmm. 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 Oh, too late. There's a nice race. Oh, why, why aren't you fighting with a bow? God damn it, man. I thought I told you. Oh well, you can wait. Um, it can all wait until I've had a drink. <laughs> to the pub. Hmm. That is sure a dragon mound there. Even more interesting, this one seems to have not been opened yet. Wonder what the hell Alduin's doing then. Is that him over there? Oh my god. Lucian, come on! You're being so slow. Why are you being so slow? Anyway. See what's down here. The grinning horker, huh? Oh, it was a pub, huh? I thought I heard skeletons. Did I? Doesn't seem like it. 
Oh, that's very interesting. This clearly used to be a pub. What a shame. Such a shame. Just a burnt out building with no alcohol in it whatsoever. Oh well. Such stories are common across Skyrim. <coughs> oh god, sorry. Sorry for all the coughing, by the way. Um, I mean, I just, I'm getting every cold. But anyway. Boom. Hmm. Well, there's sort of a little village down here. Right? Or a mill, if you will. This is Angus Mill, you say? Okay. Very interesting. I wonder if there's a merchant here. Oh, this is the common house. And you can't go in there. Don't know why it's called a common house, though. This is Aerie's house. Hello, are you, Aerie? If you're one of the Jarl's men, you'll get your lumber. Angus Mill pays its debts. One of the Jarl's men? Sorry, I thought Skald the Elder sent you. We've got an order to fill, and he's not known for patience. Sounds like Look, quite uh, heading towards Dawnstar anytime soon. Can you give the Jarl this note? Let him know he'll get his lumber. Oh, definitely. I'd be glad to help. Thanks. Gives me a reason to go to Dawnstar, at least. Uh, Good wonderful. Day. Good to meet you, Ari. Uh, hello? Careful now. Wouldn't want someone to get burned. Oh, sure. Um, I, I, This? This is nothing. Don't worry. I have it under control. Anyway, that's Windhelm in the distance there. Uh... Hmm. I think we should prob we should probably stick with the original plan here. We're we're gonna go um up to the Forsaken Cave and get Nirelli the White File. <clears throat> um, I do remember in the last episode we died quite a lot. But hopefully, if Lucian starts working on his bow, and that's an if, hang on, maybe if I take his one-handed weapon... Certainly. What needs doing? Uh, never mind. All right, then. Maybe if I take his uh, orcish sure. maul here, Let's trade. then he'll be a bit quicker on the um, archery. Uh, take that. And take that. Ah, see, there we go. Let's get back to it. Indeed. Hopefully you can get back to uh, defending me a bit. Oh, he doesn't have any arrows. That's a... Uh, mm, that's a point. Uh, ooh, hey. That is a good point. We might be uh, going back to Windhelm anyway, then. Um, oh, it's, it's just down the road here. We're, we'll, we'll get, like, a parsing horse. Yes. Ah, uh, here we are, in the old capital again. Can't just throw the big logs on the fire. Oh, sure, Niels. Nice to meet you too. Hello, blacksmiths. Fancy robes. I didn't you touch a wizard it. or something? What have you got for sale? Any yourself? arrows? Or deal some damage. Hopefully, dealing some damage, you know, of that sort of thing. Uh, ooh, Alamori's saber. That's good. Of Oblivion's Edge. If your target dies within two seconds, you fill a uh, soul gem and heal for 45 health. Ooh, that's that's pretty good. But that's meant for, clearly, bulkier characters than us. Uh, hunting bow of Kynes Flight. Reduce the movement speed of any enemy hit for 20% by two seconds. Oh, anyway. I I'm getting a bit uh, distracted here, I think. Uh, steel arrows, we'll have that. Steel got and lots and lots of iron arrows. Give all this to Lucian. Quite clearly. Uh, dee -dee 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 -dee. Doesn't really have anything else that's interesting. Okay, look. Whether Thank you very much, you uh, War yes, my Lucian, it's time for your arrows. Let's trade. Uh, oh, you've got some Forsworn arrows that I can give you. Uh, many iron arrows, some ancient lord arrows, and some steel arrows. There we go. Bye for now. Wonderful, you all stuck up. Anyway, um, there's a certain um, elvish wizard I that I should have come here to see a while back. Trinkets, odds and ends, that sort of thing. 
Yes, what um, powerful spell books do you have for me? Uh, Azure, Reconstruction, oh, Sparts, Contact, Chain. Hang on, I'm not so sure if we've got this already. Let me just check. Oh, yeah, we have it already. Oh, well. Thank you. That's that done, anyway. Captain Lonely Gale. Everyone says you're anyway, let's get out of here for the minute. Um, still can't get over the racism in this city. They'll probably go after Lucian. If they're not finished done with it, uh, doing that to uh, Dark Elves, for things. Anyway, we have business in the south. On to each march. Windhelm has always sort of like amazed me with um, the attention to uh, detail the people have put in. Like the modded versions are even better, don't get me wrong. But even the vanilla city for Bethesda, I think it's pretty good. Uh, but the thing is then, you go in the creation kit and like, if you're like me, you expect it to all be sort of one architecture really set. Don't like it here. You don't say, Lucian. Um, don't worry, we, we'll be going somewhere less snowy soon. <clears throat> anyway, what was I going to run about? Uh, yeah, Windhelm. You expect it to all be sort of um, different little pieces and bits, but like a lot of those pieces in the CK are just sort of very well glued together. Uh, makes kind of makes uh, building a mod sort of hard to do. Anyway, there's that room tower we passed uh, last time on our way here. And that's Cullen's Grove. Let's uh, try and not make the same mistakes with a uh, certain brew of the vampires this time, eh, Lucian? In that uh, we were too slow last time. Oh, yes. This time we should be quicker. Up to skivers. Don't need any of them, though, no, thank you. <clears throat> well, that's we're coming close to the giant camps, I think. What's that blog doing out here? Does he doesn't he know this is giant country? Oh, it's you. Hello, wandering That's bard. You a wizard or something? Might be. Are you a bard or something? Touche. Uh, anyway, lots of interesting scenery here. Um, you're writing all this down, Lucian. I thought we were going to write the traveler's guide to Skyrim. Minus some wolves. <laughs> you again with their songs. Oh, well, yep, this is looking very, very gianty country. Definitely. Steam crack camp. I do you hear that the giants have a treasure? And I think I'm right, but um, we should probably avoid them for now. Oh, yes. Ah, look. This is again one of the old burned out villages around here. Oh, here we go again. Oh, I think we've, yeah, we've got vampirism now, hang on. Uh, pressure of cure disease, lovely. That's what I've done. Blood fiend. Say what you've on about vampires, they've got lots of treasures on them. <laughs> And shall we go down here again? I think we shall. I mean, we've definitely got the potions for us now, so it's just a question of being faster than the vampires. Die, rats! Come on! Have at ya! None of you are going to come to life. Good. Apart from you. Indeed, Lucian. Couldn't have put it better myself. 
Okay, maybe not. Oh, okay. So it's a bit of a heavy ball to my head there. And still no diseases. <laughs> good, it's going good so far. Uh, what's this? Crush, slash, bash, and stab, huh? Oh, skill book. Very interesting. And very useful, too. It's an urn in here. It's a burial urn. Got to loot all of this treasure, you see. Mustn't eat things for the vampires. There's an urn in there. What's this? Just another door. Oh, not just another door. See? Uh, oh. Uh, nope. Definitely not what I want. But uh, more than you deserve, clearly. Just wait a while so we can re regain some health. This is looking to be a tough area. Oh, some dragon bone and whatever this says. Hmm. Don't wonder about that. You know, I am supposed to be dragonborn. Oh, some more gold in these urns. Okay. Good, good, good. Hmm. Very wide caverns. I didn't really know all of this was under each East March. You're tough, are you? Never should have come here. Really? I disagree. Ha. Hmm. This vampire was clearly some sort of scholar or other. Scroll of Fireball, huh? Very valuable scrolls. Lovely. Um, I know the diary is supposed to be there, but I uh, can't find it. <laughs> oh well. Not this time around, clearly. And I think Lucian coming to some sort of bus arena. Fus Roda! I'm a preemptive Fus Roda. These are really good sort of tough vampires, actually. Um, have a bit of poison. Oh god. It's the sword that hurts, I think. Definitely the sword. Okay, we need a level up in Magicka. Oh, we've got two perks to increase. Okay. Um, oh, I must not have spent it on intense flames yet. There we go. And I think we'll do... Probably go for another one-handed one. Ooh, Savage Strike. Okay, we'll definitely go that. Hey, Gun Green. Not enough. You will die with the rest of these bloody people. Well, the Blood Masker increases your Magicka by 50 points. Oh, I thought this was sort of specifically for um, for vampires, but it's just a nice um, little magic thing. Ah, <laughs> Khajiit Vampire. That's definitely unique. Oh, I'm sorry. Am I you? You are a bit, uh, Lucian. Don't get cocky there. Thank you so much for asking. Politely. Hmm. All this under a swamp in each smudge. You know, I might give. No, no, no. I think I've got to keep the blood mask because it's you quite. You know where you're going, don't you? Almost. You do know I've never been here before, right? Anyway, I I must keep the uh, blood mask because um. A, it's very powerful. B, I can probably sell it since I'm not planning to keep it all that much since it's not a destruction item. But uh, yeah, anyway, yeah. good for the vampires. Very evil. Um, 
there no treasure chests around here? None at all. No loot. No loot. Oh dear gods. I've just wandered into nothing, have I? Nope, okay. Apparently though these were also very uh, poor vampires. Oh well. Befits them, I guess. At least we got a cool uh, mask out of it. Come on, Lucian. Back up to the surface. We've at least had a chance to uh, practice our skills in here. Oh, unless there's some treasure there. Could be. Oh, some gold. Okay. Nope, just back to the uh, poor vampire theory. Hmm, I wonder if there's anything up. Oh no, wait, this is the exit. <laughs> um, ooh, something up there. Oh, I don't know what it is. Let, let, let's just uh, move on. Yeah, they don't have good accountants. Not at all, they just have uh, hunger. <laughs> that's, not a, that's not a job description for an accountant. More like a chef, but still. A chef of bodies. <laughs> What is that up there? Is that the floating mammoth? Dear kind. What have the gods got in store for me today? <laughs> yeah, good pay. Um, applicants must be willing to donate uh, blood every full moon. <laughs> There's a bear over there. No, no. What kind of nord would I be if I can't even face a bear? Come at me, bear! You may have a fancy mask as well, but I'm more than prepared. Can't run either. Come on. There we go. Yeah, yeah, the high off scar, I stroll. That was really, well, it wasn't really something not in uh, this playthrough. Because if I remember, I had Lydia at the time, and I gave her um, quite a strong two-handed weapon. So yeah, she was just fine with it. <laughs> okay, I wonder what this place is. Looks uh, quite foreboding. Foreboding indeed. I wonder what's here. Oh yeah. Oh, Necromancer's that's what's here. Hold it first. Oh, I think Lucian shot that at the same time as I did. More walking bones, no doubt. Okay, that's that destroyed. Oh, is that the temple over there? That sounds better than um, possible bandits. Did not really hide behind her. More bears. Sun it, there you go. Uh, whoa. What the hell is that? Trinimac cultist. Okay, brilliant. Not another one. Okay, he comes in. He's actually pretty much more powerful than me. Let's go. Lucy, did you make it out alive? Hopefully. There we go. I think we're out of his range now. Yeesh, that was really powerful. I think that's from the. Um, well, no, actually, I think that's from. Could be. Winterness. But anyway. <laughs> um, eesh, I wasn't. I really wasn't getting in there, was I? Um, oh dear. Anyway. Bandits was better than that, uh, definitely better than that wizard that, uh, guy. But uh, I've got my eye on him. And I'll be back. Definitely. Yep, I was. Bandits. I 
I can best you though. If you don't stop slacking. Ooh, God. Bullshit time. Just say the same of you. Uh, anyone else here? Yep. Or will I now? Touche! Uh, oh god, not another one. There we go. Let's hope that trick that um, worked on the orcs. Yep, it worked on him. Good. Indeed, Lucian. Go us. Go team us. So that's the outer bandits taken care of. Uh, let's see if they had anything good in here. No, not really. Oh, that's the switch to open the gate. There we go. Hello? Anyone in here? Hey, who's there? Hello? Stendar's mercy, you aren't one of them. Please, you've got to help me. Hmm, why have I got to help you? What's going on? It's my wife, Viola. I think she's being held in this tower. I thought you weren't a bandit. Calm down. Just tell me what happened. I'm sorry. I just... You're right. Let me explain. Fiola, my wife, left the farm on errands and never came back. It's been months, and I've been searching for her since. Months, you say? I heard a rumor that these the bandit bandits were ransoming the captives, so I thought she may be here. I managed to sneak past the guards and get this far, but I don't think I can go on. I'm no warrior. Please, can you look for her? Hmm, very well. I'll, I'll look for your missing wife. Thank you. I don't have much. But I can give you some coin for the trouble. One of the guards dropped this key while I hid. I wager it'll come in handy for you. Please hurry. Okay. <laughs> yeah, um... No, no, he, he's very Skyrim uh, protagonist, just because he's able to hide. Like, literally, I imagine him sort of sneaking in and... Like, just being right near the guards. And then going, huh, must just be the wind. <laughs> it's, it's quite a... Uh, very good nod to the sneak system in this game. <laughs> I mean, he did manage to get very far past, like, well, very powerful guards. A, unarmed. B, unarmored. So, yeah. <laughs> very funny. Anyway. No doubt there's lots of uh, bandits for us to fight in here, huh? I might get my uh, blue fireball out for that. Bean. Dying to see this since I got it. Flames, but blue. It was me. Your doom. Ah, another wizard. Oh, bye, Sendar. She's got me on the ropes. Ah, go get him, Lucian. Good to have you behind my back. Okay. Lockpick. Oh, good, 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 good. Oof, phew. Uh, Lucian, why are you all the way down there? Um, ugh. Making AI. Uh, anything good in here? No? Viola! Viola! No, no one there. Be that in the jail cell? Okay. <laughs> this quest is always, like, I've always been surprised how... By how very sort of fairy tale it is. I think, I think it's just um, a nod to uh, Shrek, though. I think because it, well, it's like the closest sort of correlation I can find. You know, Fiona. But then uh, Chris is looking for her, but she turns out to be a bandit all along instead of an ogre. Which that would be funny if you know you had someone turn into a bit. Oh. Maybe you did. Maybe it was me. Come on. Tap you to death. Very good. 
lockpicks. Ah, oh, they're not getting me this time. Oh, I quite agree. Wherever you are. Uh, oh, what's this note? The lady we grabbed down by the river turned out to be a feisty one. Barbag thought he could beat some respect into her, but it looks like he used too strong a hand. Uh, the boss is not going to be happy when he, she hears about this. Hmm. Very interesting. Oh, enough time for reading. More time for, uh, magicking. You're so sure about that, huh? There we go. Oh, I'll just put two and two together. This is obviously the lady they grabbed down, down by the river. Oh dear. <laughs> well, they are bandits, I suppose, so... Not exactly clean rooms for their hostages. Anyway, Viola! Let's hope it's not Viola. Oof, got to rest a bit, Lucian. It's six in the evening. Oh dear. Okay, so we did get sing Sanguinare Vampiris. But hopefully, hopefully I can get to either Riften or a shrine of some kind before uh, the curse fully sets in. Miss Wachis Tower. Ah, excuse me. Uh, Fiola, you in here? All right, Snowback. Ooh, nice helmet. Who are you and what are you doing in my tower? Stand, the stand aside, whoever you are. I'm here for Fiola. Fiola? How do you know that name? Her husband sent me. Where is she? Christer? He's here? Yes. Well, wait, do you know who he is? The fool's my husband. I'm Fiola. Or I was, once. Don't you see? I left that old scab. Came home to Skyrim and found this rabble of bandits. Didn't take much to prove myself and knock them into shape. Mm. Now every free blade from here to Windhelm wants to sign on for a piece. Oh, so so you say he, he took you to Cyril, but he came back. That is quite the story. And it won't end here. I'd die before I went back. What am I supposed to tell Krista then? I don't know. I never expected the old bag to follow me so far. Just get rid of him. But don't kill him. I don't hate the man. I just want him to go back to his farm and forget about me. Okay then. I'll try getting him to leave. Take my wedding band. Stoon only knows why I kept it this long. He'll recognize it. Tell him whatever you think will convince him to leave. The ring itself is worth a few bits. Keep it as thanks for cutting off the last vestige of an unwanted fate. Okay then. I will. Her helmet is really stunning. I think that's supposed to be modelled off like um, uh, either a Greek helmet or something else from a more ancient time. Uh, but anyway, we'll, we'll, we'll see once we get to uh, Christa, uh, Christa. Yes. Sorry. She's not even like I've murdered all of her like mercenary guards, and she's not even battered an eye. Charisma a hundred, I tell you there. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Anyway, Christer! Christer! There you are! What news? Why isn't Fiola with you? Ah, good point. Um, I found this ring, but no sign of her. The marriage band. And there's hope. She was here. I have to move on if I want to find her. Please, take the coin I promised. Blessings of Stendar on you. Good to I meet you. Find you Fiola. No, go back to Cyrodiil or where it is you uh, came from. Oh, hello. Viola? Viola? Oh, it's you. I didn't think you could handle this on your own. Did you get rid of Christer? Yep, he won't bother you again. How did... No, forget it. I don't care to know. I'm free of the little man and that's what matters. I owe you a debt and I aim to repay it. We'll see each other again someday. For now, goodbye and thanks. Okay, see you then, Viola. Oh, very weird. Power in the middle of nowhere. Is that the fang I see sticking out of my mouth? I better get the wind helm and get this vampirism cured. Or somewhere with a shrine in it anyway, at least. Um. Sure, I'll pray to um, 
elven gods just to get rid of vampirism. To the temple of the ancestors. Oh, uh, Oriel saved me. Oh, good. All disease is cured. Brilliant. Even though he only accepts some um, high elves or elves in general uh, as his um, yeah, devotees. Anyway, what's this? Is this a shack? We should probably go get uh, to Dornstar soon to deliver that letter to Skell the Elder. And oh God, it's a bear! Come back, bear! I wish to kill you. There we go. <laughs> Why doesn't Serana just pay to tell us? <laughs> I mean, true. Well, no, but that's because she she is a vampire. She hasn't got the disease that turns you into a vampire. She has to go through the whole ritual with Valian to get rid of her um, vampirism. Anyway, back to treasure hunting. Oh, treasure map free, huh? Well, well, no, she she does because you know she she does ask you. Maybe a bit of a spoiler. That, that is true, she did get it directly from Mo Moleg Bolt, but it still can be uh, cured. Because, you know, it's sort of treated as like, oh, it's it's just a, di a disease, you know. Um, <laughs> uh, the divines can sort it out. That is, that is true, actually, because it's kind of a weak sort of excuse for why it can just be prayed away, or you know, sorted out by a magic ritual, essentially. When she got it from a Daedric Prince, so, uh, anyway, I'm rambling a bit now. Uh, Lucian, I think we should probably see what this fort holds. And the bracket name or no more. maybe not, because it when does look very, uh, full on there. Yeah, hmm. I mean, well, there is sense in that, actually, because, um, you know, obviously there's the afflicted, which which can't uh, be prayed away at all. And uh, what's this place? Oh, looks like Wemmer Ruins of some sort. I don't know. Probably better stay out of them for now. It's certainly beautiful up here in the uh, East March. Not the mud crabs over there. But is it very interesting? I mean, because obviously, you know, the Daedric princes have powers which can't just be prayed or otherwise just have a quick sort. As I say, there's the afflicted with um, Periite, and with Molo Bell, there's strong original vampirism. Uh, you know, oh well. We'll probably have to wait until the next game for Bethesda to sort that out. But anyway, what's this? Mara's Den, huh? Sorry, Mr. Mokayab. It just got in the way. Let's see what's in here. Hopefully not vampires. Terribly sorry. Yes, good, you should be. Hello? Anyone in here? Yep, vampires. Vampires are in here. Boom! Get wrecked, as they say. Ooh, rich vampires. Gold necklaces, sapphires, gold rings. We'll be loaded when we get back to Windhelm. This is a smuggler's drama. This war isn't as good for business as I thought it'd be. Sure, the pay is good, but the runs are harder with all the extra soldiers on the road and fighting jobs that are uh, worth the risk is difficult. Like our current job. Guy hires us to move a bunch of crates with a few questions asked. So we get the goods here, and I take a look in the boxes uh, just to know what I've gotten myself into. What, what do I find? Bodies! The bastard has me moving bodies while well, I stripped them of their jewels and golds, so the joke's on him. Hmm. I feel like this is some sort of in universe comment on like pick, uh, players that just strip everyone of their possession. But anyway, let, let's do just that to these uh, vampires. Up, oh, one there. It's my Hammerfell steel mace. Let's see, oh. God, this is big for a um, just a smuggler's den. 
Tempus Dominus. <laughs> Ooh, wow. Favor with the Daedric Princess, Dimitri is 20% uh, lower. Well, I'm not doing, not worshipping the Daedric Princess for just now, but I will definitely take it because yeah, I can sell it for quite a lot. Dwarven Bow of the Vicious Ophidian. When you kill an enemy, you restore 60 stamina and increase your movement speed by 30% for 8 seconds. I, I'm definitely giving that to Lucian. Uh, Lucian, you can get rid of your, rid of your bow, you know. Uh, I need to try some Take whatever you need. You. Oh, definitely. And I'll give you something good as well. Here, you can have this. A dwarven bow, you see. Uh, you can give me back your chieftain bow. There we go. Right for now. What do you think of that? Very good. These are very good smugglers. I can tell. Unlike the pulse of vampires we've just been through. Hmm. Excuse me. Right then. Got to try and avoid the fort if we can. And I don't know what these drama rooms are doing in general. Or if I can even get into them. Sure would be good to know. If I can get around the other side of this mountain. Without running into all that much trouble. Hello Mr. Fox. Ah, I think we're going to have to, to do this the old Nord way. Oh wow. So that's a fort... And the temple, then. Hmm. Very interesting. More of a scar, huh? Oh, okay. I've looked at the guards. Too late, Virg. Vilp on you. Yeah, thank you, Christer. find you. Okay. Right. Hi, guys. Um, sorry. We had quite an unfortunate crash outside of uh, More than Scar. Um. Yeah, we're just doing the last bit of the Fiona crash, uh, quit, quest again, rather, and come back here. Oh, it's you. I didn't think you could handle this on your own. Did you get rid of Christer? He won't bother you again, madam. How did... No, forget it. I don't care to know. I'm free of the little man, and that's what matters. I owe you a debt, and I aim to repay it. We'll see each other again someday. For now... Goodbye and thanks. Okay, wonderful to meet you, Miss Fiola. We must be going, though. I think we should go to Dawnstar this time. Let's go out to the courtyard. Definitely avoid that rogue wizard or whatever was happening down there. Uh, oh, yes. We need to get. We still have Sanguinare Vampiris. And we need to pray that away. So, if you don't mind. Thank you, Oriel. Thank you for your blessing. Unlike uh, that which you bestowed upon your devoted servant. <coughs> Swatters, Swatters. <laughs> Vampire kill, yeah. Right then. Um, I think we need to probably actually sort out the Forsaken Cave first. So let's go up the, the mill. And hopefully there'll be no crashes there, <laughs> because it's a vanilla area. Oh, that is true. We didn't check out the sewers of White Run, which are bound to be very interesting, because obviously, like Solitude, it's a capital city. Um, hold on, I might switch to... Um, switch to Molten Lava again. We're really becoming a Volcano Mancer right now. Since this spell is really good for like every sort of opponent we come across. Oh, poor abandoned hub, uh, pub. Grinning Horker. Oh dear. Wonder what happened to it. What if they are flying? Hmm. Well, I mean, the dragons haven't been that... Uh, <coughs> oh, sorry. That much of a problem so far, so... <coughs> oh dear. Excuse me. Don't know what that was. But uh, anyway, yeah. 
Ugh, God. Sorry. I'll try not to die in peace next time uh, we do an episode. Anyway, what's over here? Oh, what's this? Oh, it's just more rocks. I thought it was a tomb, but it's it's just more rocks. Oh dear. Oh well. I think the Forsaken Cave is round about here somewhere. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Is that the village over there in the distance? Hmm. Don't know. Anyway. Okay. Yep. This is it. This is the Forsaken Cave. Oh, looks pretty for a second on the outside as well. Definitely for a second. Dear. Wonder what happened here. <coughs> hmm. Saber tooth, that's what happened. A strong saber tooth as well. Uh, let's just get some heating before you kill me. Uh, woo. Just one more strike and that would have been game over for us. A few. Let's just uh, wait here for a bit, Lucian. And there's another one. Damn cats. Down you go! <clears throat> Sun. Ah, I thought so. This is the way into the proper temple. Thought this was an ancient Nord thing. Although, Corral Mill sounds suspiciously elven. <coughs> hmm. Ugh, really, I'm sorry for all the coughing. I didn't know. Um, didn't know what's happened. Yeah. <laughs> Is that Draugr right here in the distance? Or maybe it's just Lucian. Okay, it was Draugr. Glad we've avoided that just obvious trap there. More statues, just check they aren't booby trapped. Okay, kill some Draugr. Wonderful. Ooh, ancient Nord boots and an ancient Nord helmet. Fascination and fear in equal measure. The hallmark of a good adventure. Definitely. Well said, Lucian. Um, oh, I could have... No, but I can't take them because they're not, um, they're not destruction orientated. But we would look cool, though, in ancient Nord stuff. But no. <clears throat> I'm with the quest. On with Nurelli stuff. Ah, uh, now you look like you're about to come to life. Yep, you are. Okay, down you go. Wonderful. Oh, another one. Well, see, you know, my ancestors didn't have to vigorously preserve th uh, themselves like this. It was just the dragon's plan. Oh yes. Ooh, bound to be treasure in here. Oh, no. Almost got it. Come on. Come on, baby. Nope. <clears throat> Almost. Yeah. It's almost like you've, like you've been preserved for the sole purpose of annoying this one guy. <laughs> yes, indeed. But then again, that was kind of the dragon cult's uh, purpose, wasn't it? To keep Alduin safe. So that if any Shazreen came along and murdered him, um, obviously they not just get to him quite so quickly. There we go. Oh, treasure. 
hopefully, lads have no. 16 gold for that much effort. 16 gold, not worth it. <laughs> yeah. Or or a fire spell, like me. <laughs> you going to come to life anytime soon? No, no, no. Good, may you rest in peace. Up oh, here, one. Is. I think it's going to come to life. Come on, die on. There we go. And you're dead. Right, let's do a head count. Who's dead? You aren't. And this is gonna be an ambush. Yep, just tell. There we go. <clears throat> that that's some of your training, Lucin. Use your environment to your advantage there. Okay? Okay, so you don't look like you're particularly dead so far. And we'll see. Be, be careful not to step on any of those traps or or else you'll be dead as well. You just destroy some of this tomb. So that it looks extra dilapidated for anyone else who comes in. <laughs> it's a potion of minor healing. Ancient Lord War Axe. Ooh, a potion of plentiful ma magic here. Blah. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah. <laughs> okay, who's in here? Who wants some, huh? Who wants some? Apparently, you want some. There we go. Oh, these ancient Nords made. Lots of pretty potions, I'll tell you that. And lots of pretty swords as well. Anyone else here? Doesn't look like it. Okay. <coughs> yeah. Well, the return of Aldrin, which they've heard, but obviously the ones in this team haven't exactly woken up. More wrestling dogger. Can't get me. I'm the Dragonborn. <laughs> uh, more ancient old stuff. Nothing in here. No one coming alive in here. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty much what they're doing. Stop being a drama all right. Destruction practice. Tiny, teensy bit more gold. Let's see what you had. Just some gold, okay. <coughs> you know, it's okay to be a poor drunker, but you don't have to be so poor about it. Definitely avoiding that. Good. Glad I looked up. Oh, yes. <laughs> Uh, oh, that's an expert lock. Might just be able to do that. <clears throat> Almost, come on. Nope. Almost. There we go. No doubt whoever hid this hid some gold and oh a scroll of conjure battle mage. Hmm. Very interesting. Amethyst and gold. Another burial urn. Cleverly avoid the trap placed there for us by Corral Mill. Hmm. This is going to be a trap laid in the harbor as well. Oh no, maybe not. Oh, we've got red. Come on, I have all your blocks. Let's carve you up, sir. Good. Good. 
go through here. Right, this is clearly Corral Mill. Deal with his servants. Lucian, uh, where are you again? Just carve up hi him a bit more. And get some more stamina in. Get some more magicka. Yes, come on, join me, Lucian. We've got them. Finally, at last, Corral Mill is dead. Ancient Lord Battle Axe of Crystals. 10 points of frost damage to health and stamina. Double defrost resistance. I'm having that. Definitely. Ooh, we're almost at carry capacity as well. I better sell some a lot of stuff uh, next episode and improve my um, speech skills wonderfully, no doubt. What's this? Another war of oil. Kill marked for death, huh? Sounds useful in a roundabout way. Elven armor of the here automatically calls a spectral wolf to your side to fight for you four times a day. That would be useful, I think, for. For Lucian, maybe, yeah. A wolf died, though. Very impressive, but not as damage doing as my current sword. 220 gold, lovely. Necklace of Trickling reduces the charge cost of weapon enchantments by uh, one quarter. Hmm. Sounds very interesting. Stuff sunburns. Ooh, lovely. It's got some wonderful treasure, but I definitely need to sell some of it. Otherwise, I'll get. Um, just get uh, very, very over encumbered. Activate Ancient Bowl. Oh. This must be the chamber of um, the White File. Yep, definitely. Oh, it's broken, huh? I wonder why. Oh, there's some poisons in here. Start being. This, is, this place is an alchemist's paradise, really. Plate, some fire salts. A game of dinner, but not the way out. The guy. Do you mind? In fact, I do, Lucius. Uh, Lucian, brother. Sorry. Keep calling you that. Don't know why. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah, way out. Oof. And then there's our way out. Wonderful. I thought there's this bloody freezing cave. Yeah, that's true. Mm. It's definitely sort of, well... I mean, yeah, but like, you have to give them the fact that it's still 11 years old now. Um, that's a point. Anyway, let's go back and give this to Norelli. See what he tells us to do us next. The uh, blah, blah, blah. I, I definitely mustered that. Anyway, Lucian. How can I help you? Would you like a matching armor set? Take whatever you need. Mm, that's true, yeah. Anyway, Elven armor of the here. There you go. This is yours, friend. Oh, he's putting it Let's on. Let's go. Lovely. You look very elvish, Lucian. Anyway, back to the task at hand. Fancy robes. Wizard or something? Might be old man. Oh, there's a Sue Great. Take a good look around. I'm sure you'll find what you're looking for. If uh, not, let me know. I might have it stored away. Yes, do you know where Neurelian is? Because apparently he seems to be in his bed. I'll, I'll just come up and see him. Okay? Oh, you're not in bed. Okay. Alchemy is simple. Unless, of course, you were simple. Then, I can't help you. Um, sure. Is this simple enough for you? But I brought the f file, but it's damaged. This here. It matches every description of the file that I've found in lore. But if it can't hold liquid, there's no way of knowing. How did you manage to damage it then? This is what I get for not retrieving it myself. Yeesh. You could have almost been killed by Karaman, and I... Don't doubt that they would have, but, uh, you know, sure, be an asshole about it. It was like this when I found it. Figures. 
I doubt you have sufficient knowledge to harm the file, even if you wanted to. Ugh. Either way, this is the end of it. Now, if you'll excuse me. <laughs> I'm not quite in the mood to entertain guests. I trust you can show yourself out. Here's for your trouble. Sure. Thanks for the coin. Hmm. Something told me to speak to his, uh... Assistant. Uh, hello? I'll oh, just come down the stairs here. I want to thank you for your help. I know my master can be a bit short at times. Sure, well he is dying. He only gave me five septins, and I almost risked my neck. Oh, I'm sorry about that. Even though the file was damaged, I still think your efforts deserve reward. Thank you very much. You're now, very if kind. You pardon me. I'm going to tend to Norellian. I can make his final days a bit less painful. Okay, sure. Thanks and all. Right, guys, I think we're going to end the episode there because I'm um, uh, talking about short. I've had a kind of short night, night's sleep and I've um, co been coughing a bit quite today anyway. But uh, thank you for coming and I think next time we're going to go and have a little dive down to this uh, um, manhole here. Uh, but thanks for coming. Like and subscribe. Have a good day, guys. See ya.